a sea swarm of robots saving the oceans, New Zealand Quay creates a new fault line and buying fresh air in Hong Kong. This is Planet 100. Welcome to Planet 100, the top environmental news stories of the day in 100 seconds or less. I'm Sarah Backhouse and it's Thursday, September 9th. Who can you call upon when the next oil rig explodes? Sea Swarm, a fleet of oil-absorbing robots created by scientists at MIT. Armed with a super-absorbent nanofabric, the robots can absorb 20 times their weight in oil, operate independently, and can clean continuously for weeks at a time. What's more, the robots run on solar energy and require only 100 watts of power, the equivalent to one strong light bulb. While Sea Swarm may be too late for the BP oil spill, it does offer promise for future oil slicks. A 7.0 magnitude earthquake which struck New Zealand's second city Christchurch has created a new fault line in the Earth's crust. All up, the quake damaged roads, shook down chimneys and destroyed most of the old structures near the South Island city, causing 1.4 billion in damages but injuring only two people. What's more, the ongoing tensions between the Pacific and Australian tectonic plates pushed up the soil some three feet in areas. Experts believe this to be the new fault line. And finally, a campaign to sell fresh air has been a huge hit in Hong Kong. The brainchild of NGO Clean Air Network, the spoof of a 1980s infomercial featuring popular Hong Kong actor Daniel Wu, is designed to draw attention to the wretched air quality in the city of 7 million. And that's our show for today. See you tomorrow for more Planet 100 news.